Hi, welcome you all to Pebbles. In today's class, uh, we are going to see measurement of weight. Measurement of weight already we have seen. And in last class, we have seen measurement of length and measurement of weight. So, measurement of weight, I have given only the introduction. So, now we are going to do the sums. Okay, let's start the problems. Uh, this is class 5 max. Okay, now fill in the blanks. 19.386 kilogram you have to convert kilogram and gram so look at that see this is 19.386 kilogram so you have to convert how many kilogram and how many gram so look at this this first 19 this is 19 kilogram the remaining is 386 is a gram because this is the whole number and after this this after the point we have 386 this is a gram we can consider this is the gram so i just want to explain you just 19.386 see look at this so if you want to convert this as a whole number you have to multiply by 100 because how many um, after the point how many digits three digits that's what you have to multiply by thousand so you can get 19386 then you have to divide it by what thousand means then only you can get this answer so how many zeros in uh, thousand three zeros so what you are going to do while you do while you go for division so you have to uh, what A division means that that means one that is uh, one tens hundred thousand ten thousand so from the right to left from the right to left you have to put a points so how many zeros one two three zeros you have to remove you have to take out three you have to take out three digits so one two three digits so this point is coming here 19.386 so this 19 the whole is kilogram and the remaining 386 is a what gram so the answer is 19 kilogram is equal 19 kilogram and 386 gram 19 kilogram and 386 gram now we are going to do the next sum 0 0.832 kilogram so we have to convert kilogram and gram so 0 0.832 that means kilogram see after this point how many digits this is after the point you have three digits 0 0.832 there are three digits so in this place this 0.832 is converted into kilogram as well as gram so in that kilogram place there is no what there is no number only zero so that you have to write zero kilogram and 832 what gram this is the right answer 0.832 kilogram that means zero kilogram then 832 gram it's a right answer so how could you say because look at this so after the point how many digits three digits so this three it comes under in gram and this number is kilogram because that means 832 gram because if you want to uh, if you want to uh, become as a kilogram means so look at this you have to add something because already i've told you one uh, kilogram means how many grams thousand gram thousand gram see see this is lesser than what lesser than uh, thousand lesser than thousand that means lesser than thousand means this is 0 0.832 so you have to add some grams then only you can be converted into thousand grams so this in this particular place that is uh, if, if in the in that place 0 0.832 so zero that is no kilogram and after that 832 is a gram so that's what i've written and two kilogram and 614 gram so you have to convert the entire thing as a gram so two kilogram so look at this third question two kilogram and six one four gram that means this is second question the first question first question the third question is that is c question even you can write for a b c b this is a and this is what c so one kilogram is equal to thousand gram so that means two kilogram means what you're going to do two into thousand so you can get what two thousand gram and after that 600 and now it convert into what gram 
so the remaining is also 614 gram 614 gram so 2000 add with 6 614 gram so this is also gram this is also gram so you have to add 4162 2614 gram so you have to write in that particular place 26 261214 gram this is the answer for the question see i tell you again look at this sum so 2 kilogram and 614 gram so 2 kilogram means first these are these two are completely what these two are completely different units so one is kilogram other one the first unit is kilogram second unit is gram so one kilogram is equal to thousand gram i told you already so you have to convert two kilogram into gram that means you have to convert all the units as same unit okay all the units because the different units are there you have to convert into a same unit you have to convert to one unit that is 2 kilogram means so 1 kilogram is equal to 1000 grams 2 kilogram is 2 into 1000 you can get what 2000 gram and after that the remaining 614 gram you have to add this that means 2614 gram this is the right answer for the question and after that 8.612 kilogram so you have to convert again the same thing so 8.612 kilogram that means this is what this is that is i told you once that is 8612 so how many so if you want to convert you have to multiply by 100 then it becomes what 8612 that means 8612 so again you have to divide by 1000 you can get 8.612 because from the that means you have to um, you have to uh, what uh, keep the decimal point towards to the left towards to the left means right to left so what you're going to do 8.612 kilogram that means uh, 8 is a or the whole number that you have to convert into a kilogram and the remaining 6.12 is converted into a gram so so this is a kilogram whole number is always a kilogram and the remaining after the point what are the number uh, whatever whatever the number is given in the question that is a what gram that is that you have to consider so in that place 8.612 and uh, kilogram is given so uh, how many grams that means uh, I told you it means 8000 8612 gram that means 8 into 1000 that is called as 8000 then after that 6012 it is a gram this is the also gram 8000 is a kilogram so I convert 8 sorry 8 is a kilogram and 8 is a kilogram and 612 is a gram that you have to consider so but totally if you write in the single unit that is kilogram means 8.612 kilogram that only you have to write but they are convert into gram so what i have done it 8 into 1000 first i have to convert this 8 kilogram into 8000 gram that means 8 into 1000 you can get what 8000 gram and after that the remaining 6.12 it is a gram so i have to add as it is that that's what the answer is 8612 gram this is the right answer for the question so next one is find the weight in gram see look at this uh, 0 0.42 kilogram so you have to write how many grams and 1.6 kilogram write how many gram so look at this first we have to we have done all the sums i rub it then i have to teach the next subdivisions now a second uh, subdivision find the weight in gram so the first we are going to do the first sum 0 0.42 kilogram is equal to gram so kilogram convert into gram look at this sum 0 0.42 kilogram convert into gram first second subdivision first sum 0 0.42 so first you have to write the formula 1 kilogram is equal to 1000 gram that you have to write and after that 0 0.42 into 1000 so what you're going to do you write as it is 0 0.42 after that how many zeros add the zeros as it is then look at this point see how many zeros in thousands three zeros in thousands so this point move to the this decimal point move three decimal place to the right so one two three so this point is coming here 420 after that you must put a point then you have to add double zeros 
but after the point you should not consider the zeros you cancel the zeros the answer is 420 gram this is the right answer for the question right 420 gram next see now we are going to look at the second sum 1.6 kilogram see convert into gram so 1 kilogram is equal to 1000 gram that means 1.6 into 1000 so what you're going to do you write 1.6 as it is then you must add three zeros then in thousands how many zeros three zeros so this decimal point one after the point this decimal point move three decimal place to the right okay so one this is one this is two this is three so this decimal points come here so one six double zero point then again zero so that means after the point you should not consider the zero cancel the zero one six six sorry one six double zero gram that means thousand six hundred and gram this is the right answer for the question okay